You're on board with Michael Schumacher, the pole sitter. A nice steady exit out onto the pit straight for maximum acceleration up to 185 miles an hour. Watch the red lights on the steering wheels to tell him when to change gear. Brake car down three gears. It's tighter into turn one than you think. Now be careful, you can run nice and wide on the exit up the curve. It's very smooth, heading towards three. Watch his left thumb look. He's changed the ignition setting, 170 down to 110 for turn three. Don't bring it fully to the left. Turn four ahead of you, just 75 miles an hour. Run up onto the curve. You're heading now down into the Dunlop hairpin. 175 at the bottom of the hill, down three gears, then another. Front wheel locks up, no problem. He can take a late apex, play with the throttle pedal, maximum traction on the way out, turn six and seven. I wonder if he'll have to lift the throttle. Oh, just a little breather there, 160 miles an hour now. Bring it over to the right-hand side for turn eight. Bumpy under braking, turn in early, let the car run high. Bring it over immediately to the left for nine. Balance the throttle, just gently, gently, correcting the car slightly. Up, using a little bit of grass on the exit. Now it's easy downhill through the bit curve, 165 miles an hour, 180 miles an hour now before the Vidal chicane. 75 metres before the corner, hit the brakes hard. Down to second, attack the curbs. Be careful with the back end on the way out, Coca-Cola curve. Now you'll see Michael Schumacher, he has a lot of understeer, the front sliding look. Gets on the throttle pedal, the back steps out, has to run wide to correct it, no problem. A supreme lap from Michael Schumacher, the fastest of the weekend.